Hi everybody, Nancy Rose here, author of Raise the Child You've Got, Not the One You Want. We're going to be going over each of the nine traits of the core self. Now, if you're not familiar with the concept of the traits of the core self or of the core self, I encourage you to go back and look at episode number three, which talks about what these nine traits represent. But in a nutshell, they represent the parts of a child that are inborn, the inborn temperament traits that you as a parent cannot change, but you can influence. The second of the nine traits of the core self is adaptability, which refers to how well your child handles changes in routines, plans, or the environment. Now, pay attention to the language that you use to describe your child's adaptability. Is your low adaptability child stubborn or rigid? Or is he consistent and cautious? Is your high adaptability child impulsive? Or is he flexible and open? Remember, words have tremendous power. And when we are describing our children, we need to pay attention to the language we use.